Yeah, so um, when I was young, hiking through here, I used to see these little slabs of concrete, like this one right here. This was very confusing to me doing hikes. I'm like, wait a second, why is there concrete like buried in the ground? Oh, later come to find out there used to be a reservoir up here and it actually cracked in 1963 and flooded Baldwin Hills. Five people died. Big flood, 1963, and my aunt and my mom were actually playing in the water <laughs> shortly after they moved out here in the late 50s. And so, the remnants of the reservoir did a lot of damage. I don't know how much water actually spilled into the city, but that's what happened in 1963. And if you talk to anyone who lived here back in the 50s, 60s, they'll definitely, especially if they lived in this area, then they would know about the flood. Yeah, so it did a lot of damage, five people died, and, and my aunt and my mom, they remember the water coming up to the point where they were at because they lived off of Westview. And I guess that's where the water stopped. And so, you know, they got some stories of playing in the water. Of course, my mom, she was eight, and my aunt, she was 10. Oh my God, my favorite kind of dog. <coughs> I love those kind of dogs. I'm usually a cat guy, but I love those kind of dogs right here. <laughs> it's a husky. Yeah, he looks a cut in the hat. Ah, there it is. Huskies, yes, I know. <laughs> so yeah, going back to the uh, oil dwelling. So they've been doing some expansion to this park, I guess when uh, oil continues to lose its uh, impact on this area. They've already expanded it a bit. I think in the early 2000s, they stretched out the park a little bit, but I just wanted to point that out because you'll see that when you hike through. You know, they should do what they do like at the La Brea Tar Pits and put like markers on the concrete slabs. You know how they put markers in the areas where there are fossils or where the asphalt is coming up in the ground. This should be like asphalt crack number 102 or some stuff, you know. I don't know. Anyway. One of the gems of Kenneth Hahn. Bam!